timing and the rhythm of the swing. Timing wise, we want to make sure that we get our front foot down in time to allow our hands to get to the front on our swing. A lot of people have a tendency to step way too late and they end up being late on the pitch, not having a chance to get their barrel extended. We want to make sure that this front foot gets down as the pitcher is releasing the ball in plenty of time to be able to get forward so our hands can get to the front of our body. The other thing, with our load. We want to make sure that we're keeping our weight and using it to our advantage. A lot of people call it a negative move, a load. It's called a lot of different things. The bottom line is we're going to go backwards to then go forward. The important thing to notice here is that when we load and we load down into our leg, we don't want to turn our bodies because that's creating extra movement for us to then have to return back to neutral and then go forward. When you load, you want to go down into your legs, gaining your power right here, saving it right here so that when you stride and swing, your power goes through into your hip. The other thing to notice on the load we don't want to get back here and pause if we're loading and pausing we're losing all the momentum that we just gained we want to make sure that we're going slow in a nice slow rhythm to go backwards to go forward all together and once we've loaded and now we're coming back forward we want to make sure that our body and our weight is neutral our head is over our belly button in a good attack position so that we're ready to drive our legs into our swing